Hello, people. I think you'll like this. It pays a lot, which is what you want. So there's this chemical laboratory called Humane Labs. Now that the toy door has been removed from use in Heist, I'm going back over the elite challenge guides that use them and showing an alternative to get them done in the fastest, easiest and most consistent ways possible. And in this video, I'll be showing you how to complete the Humane Labs raid from the original apartment heist. So without further ado, let's get to it. The best apartment to have is North Conquer Avenue, as this is the closest. When in the menu screen, make sure it's set to hard, and have heist clothing set to player safe outfits. There will be three main roles, one pilot, one gunner, and two for the ground team. With player safe outfits on, you can now equip your own outfits. The pilot can wear whatever they want. The ground team should both wear scuba suits to be faster swimming through the tunnels, and the gunner should wear the heavy utility vest, although this is not essential. The heavy utility vest will grant much more protection during a heist. Once everyone has their role set, everyone should choose the Hakuchu Drag as their vehicle. When the heist starts, each player gets on their bike and takes this route to the Valkyrie. The Hakuchu Drag is amazingly fast but has poor handling, so getting good with handbrake turns will make this trip easier. How fast it's done. I hope money's a good motivator for you. If you have a player who's generally faster, they should probably be the pilot role as they can get the heli ready before the other players arrive. You can turn diamonds into dust. She's all yours. Okay, here we go. Pilot's taking the controls. Aerial gunner gets first choice on position. Side facing minigun placements are in the rear. Once everyone is in the Valkyrie, the two players on the miniguns should fire backwards to speed up the chopper. <laughs> First we're going to look at the pilot's role. When flying to the Humane Labs, it's best to accelerate and ease off in bursts to help the Valkyrie gain altitude as you need to be pretty high up to trigger the checkpoint. When you arrive, pivot left to give the ground team a better angle for their skydive. As soon as they have jumped out, head down to this flat part of the mountain along with the gunner. Chopper team, there's movement on the radar to the west of you. Be ready to engage. It's mostly a waiting game while the ground team do their thing. But after this dialogue, Merryweather dispatch air units, chopper team, take them down. At least one buzzard will spawn. The ideal weapon here is the heavy sniper mark II with explosive rounds. And they're on the way out. Keep it up. Or you can use a minigun type weapon if it gets too close. Waiting in this location means you will not have to deal with the many buzzards shooting at your Valkyrie, as any more than 2% damage will fail the elite challenge. Now once you hear this dialogue, Chopper team, the ground team are swimming out through the cooling tunnel. Their signals will have gone dark, but get ready to pull them out. The pilot heads down to this small beach and waits to pick up the ground team. Let's go, let's go, 
Ground team collected, head back up and collect the gunner. Get out of there. If your Valkyrie is low enough, buzzards will not shoot their missiles at you. Once everyone is in, start heading for the final location at the Land Act Reservoir. When you hear a missile locking on, start moving the Valkyrie up and down to avoid them. Any more than one missile hit will fail the elite challenge as it will be over the 2% damage. If you reach the reservoir and still have buzzards to kill, spin around so all firepower can be aimed at them. All buzzards down, land and finish the heist. After the ground team jump out, the gunner heads to the same flat part of this mountain as the pilot. Your surveillance black spot, they don't want you drifting out yet. When they're inside, descend and provide cover. The gunner's main role is to take out as many buzzards as possible while waiting for the rest of the team to pick them up. Again, the heavy sniper Mark II with explosive rounds is the best weapon here. Our people inside won't get out if those reinforcements get there. That one's gone. Let's go, let's go. Drop any Meriwether units coming after you, then get out of there. There's more coming at you, look out! When the rest of the team arrive, the gunner can, if need be, stay here and take out some more buzzers, while the other team shoots their miniguns. But the choice is yours. Once in the chopper, the gunner can ready up with the explosive cannon on the front of the Valkyrie and help take down the rest of the buzzards. As soon as you get this prompt, Triggering the, EMP. the ground team jumps out and skydives down to the garage door. You're clear to drop. Go, go, go. Ground team, time to switch to night vision. Shooting an RPG at the keypad will open it. Okay, ground team, let's go. From here, it's about knowing where each enemy will spawn. The assault shotgun through these corridors is best. There is a possibility to get the rapid fire bug here where you can die instantly. If this happens, just restart the finale from the apartment. Knowing exactly where to go here could mean a few tries for newer players, as the corridors and turns can be a little confusing.
how both ground teams swipe their key cards. State of the art, it won't take you long to pull the data. Transfer's complete. Go down the corridor, get in the elevator. After the cutscene, they start heading out. Once at the water, do remember to press left on the D-pad to equip your re-reavers. Alright, get the breathing apparatus on and get in the And head straight down. The scuba suit here will increase your swimming speed drastically. Once out of the tunnel, head directly up and to the right to reach the awaiting Valkyrie on the beach. Set up a flare to let them know where you are when you reach land. Chopper should be inbound, get ready. Hop on the side guns and go pick up your gunner. team will now do most of the shooting. Aiming for the pilot will mean quicker kills. Once all the buzzards are down and the Valkyrie lands, mission is complete. You're clear? All right, then I'm done. Meet my contact at the Land Axe Reservoir and you'll be pinned. Guys, don't look at explosions. They blow things up and then walk. The Humane Labs Raid Elite Challenge completed in 9 minutes 37 seconds with 2% damage. And that's how you complete the Humane Labs Raid Elite Challenge. For me, this is easily the best apartment heist finale. So if you found this video useful, please drop it a like and maybe consider subscribing for more. I'm Beats Down. As stupid as you are, you are not going to talk about what happened here. And I'll see you in the next one. Some nice cheeks over there. I like that ass.